Hey everybody, how's it going? It's the Crystal Flaffy, and welcome to episode 30 of our Pokemon Prism Nuzlocke Challenge Let's Play. Now, as you guys can see on the screen, we are in a place that has a Mart and a Pokemon Center at the same time, and you know that only only happens in one area in Gen 1 or Gen 2 games. Like, some ROM hacks do have the Pokemon Center and Pokemon Mart combination thing, like they do in the later Gens, but... This one doesn't, so we're in one specific place. We are here in the Region League, about to take on the Elite Four, the Champion, all that shit. Let's get it. But before we do, I did change the team around a little. Um, we do have some of the same members that we have on the screen now. But I did replace Olympus and Triton. Reason for it? Olympus... Wasn't doing so great. Uh, he was the weakest member of our... Or, he, he wasn't the weakest member, but he was our weakest link on our team. And then Triton just didn't have the, the oomph, you know? So we gotta replace those, and we will show I will show you exactly who we replace those with. Now, first off, um, we're just gonna go through a full team recap. Um... Uh, so we have... And I did switch around items and some moves and so on and so forth with the TMs we had. So we have Kaiju, our starter, our beloved starter, the Tyranitar, holding the leftovers because she is our bulkiest mon. Um, with Rock Throw, Dragon Claw, which we got rid of Mustard Gas for because uh, going through the coverage, like the coverage that we had on our team, Mustard Gas didn't really help out too, too much. Whereas we had nothing on our team that can hit a Dragon type super effective. So just in case, I put Dragon Claw there. Then we also have Earthquake and Crunch, and she has the Sandstream ability. Next up, we have Empathy or Gallade, holding the Miracle Seed, which I need to actually take off because we no longer have a Grass type move on Empathy. But Empathy here has Drain Punch, a Zen Headbutt, Swords Dance, and Fury Cutter. And then also has the Steadfast ability. Ability. Now the reason we went with Fury Cutter is because we did end up putting a Grass type on the team, so we didn't need the extra coverage with Razor Leaf. Um, and I felt like Fury Cutter would have helped out more. It's good against what Grass types, Dark types. Um, what else is Bug super effective on? Psychic types. Yeah, it helps against other Psychic types, which is good. Um, I think that's it. I want to say that's it. Um, anyway, then next up we have Blind Eye Crobat holding the Poison Barb to power up his, his Sludge Bomb with Air Slash, Dark Pulse, which we apparently had the TM for, even though we stuck with Bite for up until now, um, and Nasty Plot. Um, and Blind Eye has the Inner Focus ability, two Pokemon whose abilities re rely on flinches. Ah. Then we have Nala, our Shiny Luxray, our natural full odds encounter Shiny that we got while grinding a little while ago with Thunder Fang, uh, Double Kick, Crunch, and Base Tremor. I really hope that my mouse is set to hidden so that you guys did not just see the mouse on the screen that whole time. Really hoping that because I did have the mouse over the emulator. So let's hope that that wasn't the case. Um, anyway, Nala here has is holding the megaphone to power Base Tremor, which is a sound type earthquake with Thunder Fang, Double Kick, and Crunch. And then she has Intimidate for her ability. Then we have the first new member of our team. We have Shakira the Ludicolo, holding the Mystic Water to power up her Surf. And then also has Giga Drain, Hyper Voice, and Hidden Power. I don't know what her Hidden Power type is, um, but it was between like dr having her no Drain Punch, which isn't that great because she doesn't have too high of a physical attack stat. Well, it's okay, but it's nothing compared to the rest, like our other physical attackers. See, 164, 134, or 137, 184, 178, you know? So her Drain Punch wouldn't have been doing too much. And we already have a Fighting type move uh, with Gallade, so we didn't need it. Hopefully Hidden Power is an Ice type move. Um, unfortunately, Shakira, for some reason, can't learn the TM Icy Wind. I don't know why. Uh, she has the Rain Dish ability. And then to our last member, we caught her in the last episode. Or no, two episodes back, we caught her. We have Blackjack, our Shiny Rapidash. We caught this one in the Shiny Ball, though. This one wasn't a full odds. It wasn't a random encounter. We caught it specifically in the Shiny Ball, which turns whichever Pokemon you caught in it to a Shiny. Um, so that's what we did there. And Blackjack here is holding the Metal Coat, 
with Flare Blitz, Wild Charge, Iron Tail, and Hypnosis just to be just to be safe. We could have went with Body Slam on it, but to be honest, Rapidash didn't get that much good coverage. The really uh, the main reason for Rapidash here is for Flare Blitz. Flare Blitz and Wild Charge, which we're going to have to be a bit careful with because of the recoil. Um, but we didn't have... Well, we did have an Electro-type attack, but we didn't have a Fire-type attack on our team. And then Iron Tail's good for Fairy-types and other Ice and Rock-types and so on. And then she has the Runaway ability, which unfortunately didn't change when she evolved. So her ability is pretty useless, but I do feel like she does help out the team a bit more than Olympus does, because Olympus just had Flamethrower and Earthquake. We already have Earthquake on Kaiju, and Thing had a 4 times weakness to Water. It had a bunch of weaknesses. But anyways, guys, that was the long-ass team recap. Um, let's first, real quick, see if we can give uh, Gallade a different item. Let's see. All those stones that we have there. Normal, Ghost, Dragon, Dark, Round, Water, Rock. I guess we can give him the Confuse Guard. Yeah, that's what we're going to go through. Sorry for this speed up sound. I'm just trying to get through this real quick. And let's deposit... Nope. Let's deposit this Miracle Seed real quick. Oh yeah, and I did grind everybody up to level 56. And as you saw, we did have those two rare candies, which you're going to use right now. Um, gotta use one on Kaiju, because Kaiju is fucking Kaiju. And who else? I kinda wanna use it on Nala, cause she's our, our natural shiny. And look, you can even see that the sh their shinies in their, like, party sprite, you know? See, Blackjack has the gray flame, and Nala has the yellow skin. Um. Hmm. This is a toughie. Let's go with... Let's give it to Blackjack, because Blackjack is our newest member. So, why not? And we got a, a somewhat decent amount of recovery items. I would have more, but we have jack shit for... Oh, you know what, what we can do? I know, sorry guys, that I am wasting all this time in the beginning of the episode, but we need more recovery items, so I'm going to sell these stones. I gotta sell these stones. Uh, I don't want to sell them all. Uh, I, I mean, I don't want to sell this trade stone. I'm gonna sell the damp rock. I'm not gonna use that. I'm not gonna use the heat rock. All right. Like I know it's stupid of us to go and sell these stones, but really need that money. Oh, I don't want to. I don't want to. Yeah, I used some, I think I ended up using some of these hyper potions at some point. Revives are useless for us. We have elixirs. Um. Hmm. We got some full heals. I do want to get another hyper potion though. Or another two Hyper Potions. But I want to have at least 20 Hyper Potions. How many Elixirs? In okay, we also have an Ether, so that's good. So we don't have to worry about that. Um, so yeah, I'm hoping to do... You know, we're not going to sell these stones. Fuck it, we're going to just go in with what we got. And hope for the best. Let's just hope for the best, guys. Here we go. We're going to do... We're going to... Oh, what? Okay. Let's go. Um, it's a lot. Lo what's down here? Nothing. Okay, I guess that's the Elite Four member there. So there's like a puzzle leading up to them. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna try to do uh, two of these battles in like two. Fuck. What's it called? <laughs> oh boy. I'm gonna try to do two Elite Four members per episode, rather than just one. Okay, here we are. And since there's a lot of ice shit here, it leads me to believe that she's gonna be an ice-type trainer. So we'll lead off with Blackjack. Uh, let's see. 
So yeah, we're gonna try to take on her and then the next person as well. Hmm. Welcome, trainer. What you've experienced on your journey is unique. Anyone could conquer the gyms and traverse Seneca Caverns, but no one would have done it as you have. You're as unique as a crystallized snowflake fluttering and tumbling through the cold mountain air on a winter's morning. I am Yuki, the master ice trainer of Nalho and your first opponent in the Rijon League. Put your best foot forward. Oh, she looks pretty cool. She looks pretty cool. Hmm. You know what? I'm debating now. Should we go, uh, one Elite Four member per episode or two? The reason for it is I just don't want the length to, like, mm. I think we're gonna go one. One per video. Yeah, because... Then I'm gonna have to decide between which trainer to put on the thumbnail. And I'm not gonna have fun deciding that. And of course it's a fucking ground type. That she leads off with first. We're gonna go to Shakira. I was not expecting a ground type. But anyway, we can tank the Earthquake. Oh, I should have Giga Drain just to get that health back. Well, Surf has more PP, so that's actually the better one to use. Um, we gotta conserve PP. Uh, we gotta conserve our healing items. We gotta do whatever we can to get through this league. Now, I was coming a Weavile. I kinda wanna go to Empathy. Because remember, Blackjack... Flare Blitz has a lot of fucking recoil. Recoil. So I'm only trying to use him. Use her. When we absolutely need it. Because I'm not trying to let her die. Goes for the agility. That's amazing because we are going to fucking destroy her right now with this Rain Punch. Should definitely Oko unless she had a Focus Sash or something. But she doesn't. She does not. Let's see what her next member is. Um, also guys, answer the question of the day, what is your favorite team member? Sorry about that, my mom just entered the room, hopefully I remember to edit that out, if I don't. Oh well. Um, Frostlass is the next mon. Ice Ghost. Ice Ghost. Kaiju would be good. We can go to Nala and use Crunch. Um, no, we'll just go Blackjack, because I'm, I'm assuming, I'm hoping, Blackjack will outspeed. Does, does Rapidash outspeed Frostlass? I don't remember what, I don't remember what Rapidash's base speed is. But let's see what its actual stat is. 152. Second highest on our team next to Crobat. Okay, so we can just Flare Blitz and destroy. Oh, this is a cool animation. It's like a combination of the fire spin. No, I don't know what the fire spin animation is in this game, actually. See, look at all that recoil. That's why I don't want to be using Flare Blitz too much. Flaley. Hmm. I know we're going to be able to outspeed and take it out. I just don't want to risk the recoil. Hmm. I mean, Kaiju can come in and rock throw, which he still has not learned rock slide. I hope I didn't just accidentally skip over learning rock slide. Like, hopefully he learns it soon. Because that's an amazing move. And to just miss out on it and be stuck with rock throw the whole time would really suck. But yeah, as I was saying, let me know what your favorite team member is going into the league. Glaceon is coming through. I'm gonna go to Empathy, because Empathy has a, a beast ass special defense stat, and we can just hopefully Oko with Drain Punch. So see, her Pokemon ranged from like 50, 53 to 56, I think. I'm pretty sure Glaceon was her highest at 56. Pretty sure. Alright, so we did take we did take it out in one shot, which was amazing. Amazing. And that's it for the first member of the Elite Four.
I think. Yes, okay, we defeated Elite Four Yuki. What a way to break the ice. By outlasting and overcoming my icy onslaught, you've proven that you and your Pokemon can withstand anything. Go on to the next room. Your next challenge awaits. Ooh. Okay, let's heal up, because we need to do that. Well, we just need to heal up Blackjack. Shakira can live with that, and she also has Giga Drain, so we can always heal her up through other means. But anyway, guys, we're going to end off today's episode right here. Make sure you lay the like button down below for me if you enjoyed, and comment below answering the question of the day. Show some feedback, some support, all that, all that shit, you know. And have yourselves a good day. Um, oh, yeah. Subscribe if you want to stay updated for the next video. Forgot my outro. Have yourselves a good day. And I'll see you guys all next time.